This is Amy from Arch Republic and here's what's hot in the Brighton Gallery this month. This is Violet Butterfly by Mary McConaughey. It is an edition of 50, signed, stamped and numbered by the artist. She has created a series of butterflies. This is one of the three which have been hand finished in 24 karat gold and silver leaf. The other three were not hand finished and our editions are 250. So the gold and silver touches really highlight the piece. Mary McConaughey grew up in Northern Ireland but is now based in Lewis in Sussex. In her early work she supplied images for a greetings card licensing agent. Since then she created art printed onto old book pages which sold incredibly well online. These were then eventually taken on by a large department store. Mary McConaughey is inspired by everything vintage and antique but brings a contemporary feel to her work. Her work is fresh and timeless, making it extremely popular in the gallery. This is Ink Panther, a Gicle signed limited edition print of just 50 by Brighton-based graffiti artist Arrow. Every print is hand finished with a unique tag in the bottom right hand corner, making each one completely different. Arrow has created huge pieces all over the world and has been known to cover buildings in San Francisco and Brighton. His tag remains on trains in India and Eastern Europe. All of his graffiti is freehand, no stencils or projectors used. Back in the early 2000s, Arrow helped to form one of the UK's most notorious graffiti crews, Heavy Artillery. Their aim was to re-establish British graffiti in Europe. He is also a member of the world-famous graffiti crew, MSK. This is The Physical Impossibility of Death in the Mind of Someone Living by Damien Hurst. This is a lenticular on acrylic print, signed limited edition of 150. Damien Hurst is one of Britain's most recognised artists of today, gaining institutional fame when he won the Turner Prize in 1995. Damien Hurst is originally from Bristol, but is based in London and Devon. He was a prominent member of the YBAs in the 90s. They were seen as part of the wider Britpop cultural movement. This piece was taken from his series of animals in formaldehyde, which also included a cow and sheep. Along with For the Love of God, which was a platinum cast of a human skull and crossed with diamonds, this print has become one of the most iconic images in contemporary art. The lenticular printing technique in this piece creates an illusion of depth, which shows the artwork off to its full glory. So check out more artists from our Bryson Gallery next month. See you then.